You've probably seen these giant works of art around Sacramento. Beginning tomorrow, there will be even more murals popping up across the city. I'm doing um, four aerialists, four women that are on the wall. They're just, you know, dripping down in red fabrics. Michelle Murta is one of the artists participating in this year's Wide Open Walls Festival. She's been painting for 18 years. Soon you'll see her work adorn this wall on the Elks Tower Casino building. There's just so much that goes into this. For her, painting this wall means more than just colors on brick. This wall is kind of like how I was maybe about six months ago. I was a disaster. It'll be transformed starting tomorrow. This is a piece by Josh Everhorn. Wide Open Walls founder David Soban walked us through Improv Alley. This used to be one of the worst alleys in Sacramento, and we've created with art and, and, uh, and installations and, and music, we've created really uh, a, just a great place to come visit. On one side, the Humanity Mural. On another wall, a mural done in partnership with the Ronald McDonald House. I think he did a pretty amazing job, didn't he? Soban founded the festival two years ago and says this year they've added concerts and street parties along with 40 additional murals. But he says it's more than just painting on walls. In Sacramento, you're going to see some signs like this just popping up. KCRA was there as a skyjack was unloaded for an artist to begin painting tonight. This wall is another one that'll be painted during the festival. Organizers say all murals are meant to be temporary, but new this year, they'll be fundraising for protective coating for some of them. Some will last moments and some will hopefully last, you know, for generations. Soban advises go see the art while it's around because you never know just how long it'll last. In Sacramento, Brandy Cummings, KCRA 3 News.